Hey guys, today we're going to do a barbecue crawl to Jalapeno Bucks Barbecue, Mesa, Arizona. Stick around. Hey guys, welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, my name is Todd and I got a special guest today. This is Sean. He's the bass player for the Crosstown Players. Also happens to be Sassy's brother, which makes him my brother-in-law. So welcome to the channel, bro. It's good to be here. So we're out here visiting uh, family in Mesa, Arizona. And what better time than to visit some barbecue joints is during the holidays. So that's what we're gonna do today. So we got a lead Thanks to Sean here, they're a new wave Mexican soul food and buzzsaw barbecue joint. So we're going to find out exactly what that means. They don't claim to be any kind of barbecue style. They're not Carolina, they're not Texas, they're not uh, St. Louis, they're none of that. And they're proud of it. They're an Arizona style barbecue joint. So we're so I've come here today to find out what does that mean. And Sean's going to help us out here. So we're going to go in, order, you know, we haven't called anybody. I emailed. I, I thought I had emailed the uh, owner, but I'm not sure. They don't know we're coming, so we're just going to come in here, order a little bit of grub, and then uh, I'm going to go for the brisket and the pulled pork sandwich. I'm not sure what you're going to go oh, for. you got to get the brisket when you come. So we're going to try the brisket. Uh, looks a little busy, but uh, we'll do a little bit of tour uh, once we eat, if we can find somebody that's willing, and uh, we'll just uh, let you know what we think about it. So let's get started. Hi, um, I'd like to place an order for a quarter pound beef uh, brisket sandwich with coleslaw for here, and then the rest of the order will be to go. And that would be one green shredded beef burrito, three green beef. Did you want cheese on that burrito? Yes. Three green beef quesadillas, two bean and cheese burritos, and one side of rice. And uh, small iced tea. Can I get a, uh, a quarter pound brisket sandwich with coleslaw on top and a quarter pound with pork sandwich with coleslaw on top? And I'll take a IBC cream soda. Oh, uh, that's it. What's the name for your order? Todd. I ordered the quarter pound brisket sandwich with a little bit of coleslaw on there. Mm -hmm. Keep that nice and simple so we could uh, really see what that brisket has to offer. Yeah, there we go. I got the quarter pound sandwiches. I got two of them because I can never have enough good barbecue. But I got a uh, quarter, quarter pound of uh, brisket and a quarter pound of pulled pork uh, with coleslaw on top. So we're going to check that out here in a minute yep. and uh, hopefully get a, sh a seat in the shade here, I think. So, yep. Can't wait. All kinds of things here. And uh, we picked up extra because we're taking some home. Uh, can't leave the ladies out. Well, it looks great. Uh, can't, can't wait to dig in. And uh, so I think I'll just, without further ado, yeah, again, what is it? You're eating, uh, what So is I got the uh, quarter pound brisket sandwich with coleslaw. Okay. Let's check it out. Mm. Nice and tender brisket. Very tasty. Nice little balance, a little sweetness from the coleslaw. You taste a little light smoke on the uh, brisket. And the roll is really nice and uh, fresh. So. Mm. Roll. A nice roll, yeah. I think they toast all the bones. They, they do, and, and I think that adds, kicks it up a notch. Yeah. All right, so I'm going to go with the brisket sandwich first. Now, this is a quarter pound. And uh, let me just show you right off the bat what that brisket looks like. Looks pretty good. Pulls right off. Mm. Nice and smoky. I'm going to go in. Got a nice amount of smoke. It's just right. I love the coleslaw. I like that tanginess you get from the coleslaw around the top. I want to say I taste some cheese in there. I'm not sure if there's cheese in there or not. I'm going to take a look at it. Yeah. You know, I, I don't taste any cheese, but 
That must be the butter in the uh, bun getting toasted or something like that. Um, pulls apart really easy. This is really delicious. It looks like maybe I got some from the flat, and that's okay. It is, tastes really juicy. It's not too dry. I say thumbs up on that. Let me show you the pulled, pulled pork. Now, usually pulled pork, I prefer a little bit of sauce, but I'm going to give it a try without the sauce. Yeah, it looks like. Oh, yeah. All right. Yeah, and it looks like uh, they're leaving the sauce up to you, so. Mmm. Nice and smoky. Tastes really smoky, but you know what I'm going to go for? A little bit of the sauce, because I'm just a sauce person when it comes to pulled pork. That's okay. Okay, it's a sweet sauce. And I'm not sure if there's any vinegar in it at all. It tastes really good. So let me give this a bite. Okay. Really good. Really good, you know. It's not overdone. They didn't mix a lot of stuff into the pulled pork after they smoked it. It's definitely pulled. Again, the right amount of smoke. Can't wait to find out what kind of wood they use. We'll try to find somebody here in a minute to show us their smoker. Uh, but it's really good. Again, that coleslaw right on top really adds a nice little texture to it. Even a little hint of vinegar, but you know, it's almost imperceivable. I, I, I doubt there's any vinegar at all. That would be a Texas style, I think. And this place says they're not Texas style. Arizona style, Arizona. whatever that be. Arizona style. <laughs> so it's pretty good. So we're going to get to eating here and grubbing, and we'll get you on the back end. Caden. Hey, how'd you enjoy your dish? What'd you have? I'm, I mean, it was great. I actually am from Texas, so I think I'm kind of a barbecue snob, and it's about the best, the closest thing you can find here in Arizona. Uh -huh. So, Texas style is awesome. I, I try to do Texas style. So. They say they're not Texas style or any kind of style. They say they're Arizona style. So, what do you think about that? I don't know. I mean, I got I got a bunch of chips and salsa to start my barbecue sandwich off. So. <laughs> it tasted good, though, right? It was great. It was. I agree. It was awesome barbecue. Okay. You have any idea what Buzzsaw brand barbecue is? So maybe barbecue with a with a you know bit of heat or something. <laughs> I don't know. All right. Hey, thanks for uh, thanks for coming. Uh, Thank you. All right. So that was pretty good. Uh, I really liked it. Unfortunately, they're a little too busy right now with the lunch traffic to uh, give us a tour of their smoker. Um, and I believe, based on the pictures from social media, it looks like a, a Southern Pride or something close to it. Um, you know, big rotisserie, multi-rack smoker. It doesn't look like a, a thousand gallon propane tank smoker. Uh, but it definitely tasted good. Um, you know, I, I couldn't seem to find anybody that knows what Buzzsaw brand barbecue is. I, I think maybe that's, you were saying it's maybe a, a sauce? It could be, and it's still a mystery, so we're gonna yeah. see if we can, maybe we come back and try to yeah. try to find out at some point. If you guys know what Buzzsaw brand barbecue is, hit us up in the description, let us know, because I don't know. Um, but definitely, I would probably give this place thumbs up. Great barbecue place. Two thumbs. Two there thumbs up, two sticky, greasy thumbs up, because it was really good. Okay, we're back at the uh, Rochin Homestead from uh, Jalapeno Bucks and Sassy here has got a uh, what? What is that? A beef, uh, a beef quesadilla. Beef a green bee, a green chili um, quesadilla. beef quesadilla. Okay, oh, so give it a try. Now it's been about 30 minutes or so, so we, this is uh, be considered leftover barbecue from Jalapeno Jacks. Okay, first impression oh, is oh. that um, the other <laughs> matching side of my quesadilla is missing. It's underneath. And it is, oh, weird. Okay, well, okay just so anyway, up, up I'm gonna around. try this. Okay. Um, where's the beef? This is cheese, I wanna try the beef. Try it today, okay. First impression. Waiting for that green chili to hit. It's tasty. Tasty? It's tasty. Overall, you know, what would you give it? Um, from a famous place like that, I expect something a little more spectacular. Uh-huh. But, um... More spectacular? What, like with diamonds place. encrusted on it or something? No, like crusted cheese on top of the quesadilla, you know? Like the way I do. Okay, Like the well, way Sassy does? <laughs> no, it's me. All right. <laughs> it's pretty good. Here, I, gotta post I give it a... Just delete that whole thing. <laughs> <laughs> I, 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 
Yeah. Two and a half. I guess it gives me a, per, a two oh, person. Uh, okay, just, Annette, what do you think? It looks good. <laughs> Hi. I think it's pretty tasty. Um, what did you get? I also got the beef and green chili and cheese quesadilla. Uh -huh. um, I'm, I wish the um, quesadilla was a little crispier. It's kind of pull apart. Right, but then it had Cheesy. it had to travel, and it did get steamed. Correct. We did order so it got a, a little soggy, yeah. but it's still That's warm and it's very delightful awesome. in my mouth. The hot so sauce is very tasty. Oh, Jolie. Sean, the bass player for Cross Town Players, is wife. My green chili beef burrito is delicious and gooey and chili. yum. Ooh, look oh, at that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, Perfect. That's, okay. That's sexy. What do you think? Uh, what do you think delicious. Person? Delicious. Got that smoke flavor in there at all or anything yep. like that? You think it tells you it's Arizona barbecue? Perfect green chili in a burrito. Totally Arizona barbecue. Okay. So I want to ask everyone a question. I'm going to start with Sassy here. Answer, if you really don't know, that's okay. What is Buzzsaw brand barbecue? I don't know. What is mm, Buzzsaw? That's very good. I have no idea. I have no idea. I have no clue. Okay. There you go. We still don't know what Buzzsaw brand barbecue is. So if you know, hit us up in the description. Tell us what is Buzzsaw hot. brand barbecue. And tell us what you guys consider to be Arizona-style barbecue. We'd love to hear from you. See you later. Woo -hoo!